hi everyone welcome back to our channel in this video i would like to give the statement of fundamental theorem of finite differences and examples on it okay see the statement of the fundamental theorem of finite differences if f of x is equal to a not into x power n plus a1 into x power n minus 1 plus a2 x power n minus 2 plus so on last but one term is a n minus 1 into x and last term is a constant and here a naught what is a naught coefficient of highest degree term should be not equal to 0 is a polynomial everybody knows that this is the standard form of a polynomial in terms of x of degree n of degree n then according to fundamental theorem of finite differences the nth order forward difference which is represented by delta power n of this polynomial should be equal to n factorial into a naught into h power n this is the formula for nth order forward difference of a nth degree polynomial here we should observe that n is nothing but degree of the polynomial a naught is the coefficient of highest degree term and h is called interval difference otherwise step size okay interval difference otherwise step size also n plus one third order also n plus one third order forward difference which is represented by delta power n plus one f of x should be zero if a given polynomial is a nth, nth degree polynomial then its n plus one third order forward difference should be zero suppose given that f of x is a fourth degree polynomial in terms of x then its fifth order forward difference should be zero no doubt at all okay this is the statement of fundamental theorem of finite differences don't forget this both formula okay see the example if h is equal to 1 then find delta power 10 nothing but 10th order forward difference of this polynomial okay this is very very important one see first of all we should find out the highest de degree term of x okay that's why first multiply x terms only so x into x here it is minus so negative x into positive 4x square it would be minus 4x cube into multiply these both parts just multiply all terms of x only minus 6 times of 9 which is minus 54 x cube into x power 4 since bases are equal you should add the powers x cube into x power 4 nothing but x power 7 so again multiply x cube into x power 7 you will get x power 10 bases are equal you can add the powers 3 plus 7 is 10 and a minus 4 times of minus 54 should be positive which is 216 so 216 x power 10 anyway by multiplying these all terms you will get 10th degree polynomial and i don't want to the remaining terms i don't want to find out the coefficient of x power 9 x power 8 and so on okay i don't need it anyway i got a 10th degree polynomial inside so according to this fundamental theorem of finite algebra finite differences replace n is equal to 10 okay n is equal to 10 and what is a naught coefficient of h degree term which is 216 and what is the interval difference h interval difference h is given as 1 that's why the result should be 10 factorial into a naught is nothing but 216 into h power n so 1 power 10 so anyway it is 10 factorial into 216 okay now see the next example so here also provided that interval difference otherwise step size h is equal to 1 then find delta cube of 1 minus 2x into 1 minus 3x into 1 minus 4x actually we have to multiply this all three factors and we have to find out the polynomial but it is not necessary just multiply the 
x terms only just to multiply x terms only minus 3x into minus 3x it would be 2 3s are 6 x into x x square into what is the another x term minus 4x don't forget this negative sign minus 4x anyway it is minus 24 x cube if we multiply these all factors you will get a third degree polynomial so i will write as delta cube of minus 24 x cube and i don't want to find out the remaining terms in this polynomial so we have to find out third order forward difference of a third degree polynomial that's why i will apply this formula so here n is equal to 3 so replace n is equal to 3 in the above formula so 3 factorial into what is a naught coefficient of highest degree term which is minus 24 into what is h 1 1 power 3 so 3 factorial is nothing but 6 into minus 24 okay 6 20s are 120 and 6 4s are 24 that's why you will get minus 144 in this way we can complete the problem okay this fundamental theorem of finite difference is very useful when we have to find out higher order forward differences of a polynomial okay in the next video i will give some more problems on finite differences thank you very much